These are the front wheels from my old Pontiac Montana minivan. They've been neglected, they're covered in baked on brake dust. They look like they need to be repainted, but I think we can clean them up. In today's video, I'm going to show you the trick for removing baked on brake dust. If that interests you, stay tuned, we'll get started. I use phosphoric acid to dissolve brake dust. I get it at my local hardware store. You'll find it in the paint department alongside solvents like paint thinner and mineral spirits. This one is made by Clean Strip. The bottle says concrete and metal prep. The process is really straightforward. Wipe the wheel down with acid and let it sit until the brake dust is gone. I'm using shop rags to apply the acid. What's interesting, the acid reacts with the dye in these rags. It turns them blue. It takes a little time for the acid to dissolve the brake dust. I'll keep applying it, keep it wet, and let it work. I'm going to speed up the footage here so you can watch the acid dissolve the brake dust. It took about 10 minutes for the brake dust to be completely dissolved. I did use a plastic scraper to help with the most difficult areas. I'm happy with how that turned out. So now I'm going to rinse the wheel down with water. One thing to note, phosphoric acid will eat concrete and it will eat mortar. So when you're done working with it, make sure you rinse all those surfaces really well with water. Phosphoric acid will remove iron deposits. So it will remove the brake dust that comes from the rotor. It will not remove brake dust that comes from the pads. To get that off the wheel, I used an old clay bar and I clayed the wheel. So now that the wheel is clean, the brake dust has been removed. I'm going to polish the wheel with some rubbing compound. I'm going to finish the job with a little bit of silicone on the tire. Just adds that icing on the cake. So here's how it turned out. The phosphoric acid removed all the brake dust and the polish shined it up really nicely. If it weren't for the giant dent in the rim, this wheel would look new. I'm not actually going to put this wheel back on the van. I did the other three wheels and they turned out so nicely that I wanted to share the process with you guys. I'm going to replace this wheel with a new wheel and tire. If your wheels are covered in brake dust and wheel cleaner just isn't cutting it, give this a try. I hope you found today's video useful. Until next time, thanks for watching.